All right, second question. This comes from Jim, the CFO. A technical question. Jim asks, when you develop your weekly plan, do you do your written version first, or do you update your Trello board first, or do you do both simultaneously slash iteratively? So this is a great a great opportunity to, pl to plug our core ideas. We were just talking about this in the opening of the show. If you're wondering what Jim is talking about with weekly plans and Trellos and updates, go to the YouTube page, go to the core ideas playlist, watch the core idea on time management, and you will know exactly what he's talking about. All right, so Jim, here's my technical answer. When I do my weekly plan, writing out the weekly plan is the last step. So I go through a bunch of things. I go through my Trello board and do organization there. I clean things up and move things around and take things off and see what's going on there. Uh, I go through my calendar for the week and I look through my semester plans, what other people would call quarterly plans to, to remind myself what I'm working on. As I do this, I take notes. I take it in a, a text file on my desktop, workingmemory.txt. And I'm just taking a bunch of notes. Oh, here's some tasks as I was organizing my Trello boards. Here's some tasks that are important this week. I'm looking at my calendar. I got to remember these big things. I, very unstructured here. I'm just taking notes of stuff I want to remember. And then I use those notes from the workingmemory.txt to write my weekly plan. So I do all the steps, look through all my systems, review all my stuff, take notes, use the notes to make the weekly plan. That is how that works. 